All right, guys. I need some hypothetical feedback, by the way, now as well. Not related to Sonic Blast, man, but I need to ask you guys something. <laughs> how hard, how hard should I make Kevin Costner's Waterworld? Because... I had someone test stage one. And they kind of wanted to rage quit before they even got past the first enemy. <laughs> because you got to remember, every time you game over, you have to put 40 coins in again, and putting 40 coins in is like tedious and annoying. That's like the gimmick. But I want people to at least like know that they can keep progressing. Like, I thought it was easy, but like, this person got really pissed off and wanted wanted to rage quit after putting in like $40. Without beating the first enemy? So I'm like... Mm, maybe I'll make it easier then. So like, I don't know. Because there's just... It's not just a meme game. I've put so much work into it. It's like so elaborate. Like, it's like a proper game. <laughs> a proper game within the bounds of what was shown in The Simpsons at least. I have to keep in the spirit of what was shown in The Simpsons. But man, I don't really want people to rage quit. <laughs> None of them, Colin. <laughs> None of them. Uh, this is getting really hard, by the way, this game. I forget how hard this gets. I don't know. I think I'll have to have different people test it. I want different people to test it and see how hard it is. I don't know. Different people test. <clears throat> I mean, it is a meme game, but it's a meme game that has a lot of cool shit and effort put into it. That's, well, that's the whole thing. I want people to see that there's enough effort put into it that they want. Oh, bird! Little bird! People need to have the interest to want to keep playing it, even though it's fucking annoying to play because of the 40 quarters every time you die. 